there is a situation that you went through. I and guess. Um, it was very shocking. Mm -hmm. That's something that you had to go through, you know, publicly. Publicly. You didn't really have right. time to cope. It was out right. quick. It was out very quickly. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? I be getting emotional when I talk about this. Um, because because right. I did not understand. Ooh, okay, it's all over the place. Okay, so I'm, I'm still trying to figure out why this happened. Why did this happen to me? I wasn't in an argument with anyone. I wasn't going back and forth or arguing with anyone. None of that took place. Now, what I walked in on was that with mm -hmm. other people, not me. When I got in there, I was consoling the person, like, because the person was crying. I'm like, why are you crying? What happened? And when the story got explained to what happened, I was like, oh. Everybody's mouth literally dropped. When I, like, came back to it, everybody's mouth was still like, this is the, the part I want to talk about, the processing part. I would wake up, wake up out of my sleep crying. Shut up. And not knowing why. So when I contacted the therapist, she said, it's trauma. Trauma will wake you up out of your sleep. Mentally, I was thinking about it in my sleep. Right. Because I still don't know. I don't bother nobody. I don't argue with people. I don't get online and cut up and do what mm -hmm. everybody else is doing. Ooh, Jesus. I'm trying not to get emotional. Can we get some tissues? I'm trying not to get emotional. A couple of days after, I was like, Lord, I'm, you suck. I didn't understand why this happened to me. Because right. the thing is, I could have lost my life. <clears throat> you know the right hit. You, you could be out of here. Out. It right. could have been a lot worse. Brain dead, vegetable, right. everything. Yeah. And we know that you and Tamar are very good friends. Mm -hmm. She eventually did speak out, but a lot of people were saying, why didn't she speak out a lot sooner? Now, for you, how did you feel like when she did speak out? Did you feel like she did the right thing for you as um, far as the situation? I wasn't going to speak out. Even a week later, she was still in shock. She called me every day, every second, every minute, every hour, every, like... Because sometimes in situations like that, you don't know what to say. You don't. Yeah. Especially when it's no reason for it. Mm -hmm. When I go to sleep, I still see the moment. Like, I still see the moment. Yeah, it's going to take a... <clears throat> I mean, that's not something that you just get over. You don't. You know? But as a strong black woman... Mm-hmm. That you, you, you are... You keep it pushy to keep it moving. <laughs> right. You're still taking legal actions. You're still... You know, you got to... Let me tell you. God don't play with me. For real. He don't play with me for real. That's right. For real. He Hold don't play down. with you. Mm -mm. He don't, but uh, he, he like to joke you. a little mm -mm. bit. Man, he dragging it down, bro. Like, how long this shit happened? Six months ago? It had to been six months at least. Tell me something. He's still traumatized. He wake up out of his sleep. He could have died. Like, you could tell who ain't never get punched in their damn face before. He ain't never have a fight growing up. Like, come on now. I done got hit in my face before. I done got in some fights. I ain't say, oh my gosh, I'm traumatized. Six months later, I could have got hit and fell the wrong way and died. And oh my gosh, my therapist. Like, bruh. I can see if he got stabbed up, shot, hit by a cow, or a flying object. This nigga got punched in the damn face, bruh. Like, come on now. And he's supposed to file the lawsuit. I ain't see Krishan had to turn herself in, or I ain't see that Krishan had to settle out of court or anything. So, what the hell is going on with that? When it first happened, everybody was like, lock her up, lock her up. She did it. She did, lock her up. And no proof. Still to this day, no proof. All we got is him sitting in a damn dentist. Some people say there's a picture that's out, like, of his teeth, like, bleeding or something. Like, if, like I keep saying, if this shit happened, why she not charged? Why she ain't facing no consequences? Why is she still free to do what the hell she want to do? This nigga going on podcasts. Tell me something, oh my gosh, I'm about to cry. This and that, man, shut the hell up, nigga. You got hit in the damn face by a girl. So what? Nigga, man up. <laughs> hey, this shit is hilarious, bro. They, they over there just like, I know, you, you, you still processing it, it's okay. You want me to get you a tissue? They over there baby in his ass, like grown ass man. Nigga probably 41. Tell me something, you having nightmares. What that nigga said? <laughs> I'm surprised he ain't saying I'm waking up in cold sweats, I can't eat, I can't sleep. Like, this nigga is dragging it, bruh. That's all I'm saying. What y'all think about this, your boy? Be